So, this is going to be our DIY project. Ron had this canvas um, in his previous decor, right? It's a nice size canvas. And I'm just going to freestyle, abstract, nothing to it. I got a variety of paints right here that I just kind of took out of the garage. And we're just going to make art. Because that's what abstract art is all about. to it oh I'm, I'm loving how this is running just gives it a little bit more texture literally no rhyme or reason to it but all the colors that very neutral very i love it it's just it looks messy but it looks beautiful in my look beauty is in the eye of the beholder okay it's not me might not be for you sis cousin uncle aunt excuse me but i love it i don't know where i'm gonna put it but it was definitely um fun to color up to cover up the existing uh paint that was on it so this is how it looks look at that just call me picasso sharon honey i'll take it. i like it i love it's just so texturized the paint did go on thick purposely to give it a little bit more you see that a little bit more off and not just like flat you know and that is that she's pretty 
let me know. Yay or nay for you. And I won't be offended. I assure you. I like it. Can't wait to see when Ron see it. I almost think I might have a place to put it, but I'm not real sure. But let me com le let me comment. Leave me a comment down below. Yes, Sharon, it's a go for me. No, Sharon, and not my style. Doesn't matter. I still love you anyway. Okay? Okay. As promised, let me show you the credenzas. Totally different. More, more, very much more champagne. The doors are back up, as you can see. And again, those are going to be covered, but that's not what I'm here for. And to be honest, I haven't switched the knobs around from the back side because I am on the hunt for knobs. And again, Ron still has to put my legs on, which are sitting behind me. And he said that he would probably do that for me to today. Um, you may recognize this as well as this is from the house because I foresee a couch right here. I already told you guys. I foresee a couch rug from the office which totally goes here, here, here. And I'll turn around and show you like. So basically I see a couch. I, well, I see one or two things. Let me just let me just say that. I either see my desk here facing out and I see a couch here, right? Um, and I see those two bookshelves. I told you guys that I want to put against those two windows back there. He's going to um, take this TV and stand out of here. The plant, that situation, oh, no, and the stuff over there in that corner. All that will go, right? Um, I'm still not like 100% sure like how exactly I wh what I want to put on them what I want to have on them I don't know yet if I even want to because in the penthouse on the wallpaper wall I had that mirror and of course that wall was much smaller than this wall so being that the wallpaper is giving me everything I need in my life I'm thinking about hanging mirrors or a mirror over one of them because here's the thing <sighs> one of these is going to house like literally my 86 inch tv will fit on one of these there's the one in that room i know you're saying okay sharon what the heck two rooms side by side yep absolutely my tv one of them will fit on either this one or this one. I don't know which one yet, depending on where I position my desk, either over here or couch where I'm sitting. Or when that gets blocked, excuse me, when that gets blocked off, I may put the desk there. I ain't sure yet, excuse me, exactly what flow I know. But what I do know is these are staying because I love them. They're absolutely beautiful. I'm so glad I scored two. They take up that big ass wall and the faux wall is giving me my life as well as a backdrop. I love it. So again, I don't know how I want to decorate at least the one because one is going to be filled up with a TV. Or I also have another option too. I have another option, but I don't want to block any more of these windows because it's still... As you can see, a ton of windows in here. So even closing that off, like I said before, these windows done nothing. Nothing. I still get so much light in this space. And you probably definitely can't tell on camera exactly how huge this room really and truly is. But anyway, this this is the um, the credenzas. This is very much more of the color I was going for. Not quite the, the pewter, but it's still way more lighter, softer, and it just really flows with the, uh, it's almost actually the same color as the little metallic gold in the wallpaper. There. I love this. I love it. I love it. I love my pieces from home. 
again, when that TV is out of here, that won't look so crowded-y and like all of this stuff or whatever. It'll just, you know, um, be just right. You know what I mean? It'll be just right. And then when I find the perfect knobs, the thing gets the legs on it. <laughs> we'll be good to go. I absolutely love these dinosaur heavy situations. But again, I'll keep you guys posted. This is just where I am so far. And he has one of his beautiful plants in here getting some sunlight. Um, I put the blinds up for it to get sunlight. And all these yellow leaves right here needs to really come off because they will suffocate the other ones. So rather you think I know anything about plants or not, I do, sis. See this yellow one? He needs to go because he's going to suffocate his cousins his siblings so we'll just get these old ones out um and there's another one over here that is dead come on baby come out okay and we have one more so over here hanging his plants are flourishing they're really flourishing um, so this is the one that's in here. And again, yeah, so you see some stuff you see from home. Let me fix these curtains right here. Um, I love these sheer curtains. They just give me girly, just give me girly vibes. I love, love, love them. Um, anywho, that's the update, you guys, for the credenzas. I do need to clean them because, again, I literally just pulled the tape off. I want the legs on there, and then I'll go back and clean, you know, the mirrors, find my knobs, all that jazz. I'll bring you along the whole process of this room. I'm so glad that the doors are back up because now, let me show you. Now, go all the way back here. When you come in, now that the doors go all the way back over it. Well, which way am I going? Say hey, buddy. Say hey, Remy. Don't nobody owe you no money, so you ain't got to be giving nobody side eye. Nobody owes you any money, or do you owe somebody money? Because you look like you owe people money, and you feel guilty about it. And that's why you be giving them the side eye. Is that what it is? Oh, it is. Okay. All right. My bad. Okay. So look, come in. I'm at the, the door right here and all the way over there. Now that the doors, I'm out of breath. Now that the, the doors are up, you can't really see the wallpaper like that. And you definitely won't be able to see it on that far left side because that door is getting ready. Not door, but it's going to be covered so that that glare won't be all in my way when I'm in here watching this TV. So same huge TV will be in this room over here as well. It's the girl cave. It's when I'm drinking wine with my girls and doing work and yada, yada, yada. I do want to go, let me say this, with a much smaller desk than the one that I know I just got from ikea for the other uh office at the penthouse i do have two tops i have the larger size top and then i have the um the smaller one too i have both of them and then of course the side pieces that go on with the drawers on there um and then the top piece too so to be honest with you i don't know y'all uh and this this door here this this one is stationary like you can open them both obviously as you can see but this one you can keep closed and just use this one to come in and out of you understand what i'm saying so i could put my desk here and not worry about the doors being a problem and still be fine here with the couch here tv over there or over there whichever space way I decide to go with it or whatever um yeah so I'm still figuring it out because 
it's a lot in here. It's a lot. I love the rug in here too. Save myself quite a bit of money because this rug still looks brand spanking new. But here's the credenzas, much prettier in this tone, I believe. Let me know down below. Did you like it the original way, or do you like this more lighter, closer to champagne, but not quite? better than the um original color that it was when i first bought it let me know your thoughts down below i hope you enjoyed today's video the paint along the paint with me the whatever the whatever and i keep you guys posted um if you aren't subscribed to the channel feel free to do so if it will allow you to turn your bell on because hey you never know what might pop up on this here channel over here with the fab crew I love you guys so very much. To the morning back. Thank you for all your support and allowing me in your home. And I welcome you into both of mine. And I will catch you in what? The next video. Bye.